Hi, good afternoon everyone. My name is Amrita. I work at the Indo-German Chamber of Commerce. And today I'm here to speak a little bit about uh, the Indo-German startup initiatives that we at the Chamber are working with. A um, little bit about the Chamber. Um, I think uh, my boss, Mr. Sumit Sharma, the regional director here, also spoke about um, this morning. We are here in uh, India for the past uh, little over 60 years now, and we work with uh, different binational relations uh, and business internationalization from Germany to India and vice versa. And in Bangalore, we also work with the Indo-German Training Center. There's also a stall outside. My colleague uh, is also here. In case you're interested, you can also go around and check it out. And without much further ado, I just want to speak about the startup initiatives and not keep you away from lunch for too long. So traditionally, the chamber has been working predominantly with large uh, German corporates here, also from the SME sector. But for the past four years or so, we have also been working actively with startups. The first project that we really started with startups was Startup Asia Berlin. This is a project from Berlin connecting Berlin with other Southeast Asian communities, and that is Bangalore, Manila, Jakarta, Singapore, and so on. And this is more like a networking platform where they go to these cities in the form of roadshows, understand the market, and so on. And the next program is the German Indian Startup Exchange program, which is more uh, specifically only for startups, whereas the other is also for ecosystem representatives. And here there is a delegation coming to India and hopefully also vice versa in from the coming years as well. And the next project that we have is uh, Bixan, which is the Bangalore Indo-German Startup Network, a very uh, close to the heart pet project uh, from the Consul General, uh, Mrs. Helwish Buter, and also the Indo-German Chamber. We are working on it together jointly. And the first reason that we really started working with this is there was a situation that we saw because from the Chamber's perspective, our biggest strength is uh, the industry body, right? With that being our competency, we did understand that for some of the German corporates, it was difficult to work with startups. I mean, there are a lot of programs in terms of incubation or mentorship and so on, but um, we saw that there was a necessity to drive acute business collaboration between the German corporates here in Bangalore and also uh, benefiting the startups here in Bangalore. So with that in perspective, we uh, started Big Sun. This was more like a, a simple get together meeting with different companies coming together, brainstorming about ideas about how to make a difference in this space. And then over a period of one year, we actually uh, started having a logo, started meetings uh, more structuredly, getting startups on board and so on. And we are doing it as, as lean as possible. I should say this itself is a startup in many ways because uh, like Joe's <laughs> put out, we don't have a lot of funds for this and we are taking every event as its own. Luckily, we do have extreme support from the corporates here in Bangalore, if you see uh, most of the German companies are a part of this. They do see value uh, in having a program like this. One might ask, uh, why cannot they do it by themselves? But there is a difference we see when it comes together from neutral bodies such as uh, the consulate or the chamber, bringing in together different parties and also bringing uh, startups together and creating a kind of cross-pollination. And uh, with uh, that, uh, these are some of the startups who actually got to pitch uh, in front of the previously said corporates. And slowly, sorry for the very cluttered slide, slowly the number of startups are increasing. Hopefully the next time I do this, there are a little more startups um, uh, who are being benefited by this program. And the engagement so far, these are some of the programs that we had. Officially, we had a meeting on October 17th last year wherein we invited all the corporates in our uh, as, as a, who are our members and actually ask them if something like this would even make sense. We had curated quantitative surveys that went across to understand what, what are their pain points when they work with startups, what are the uncertainties that they are plagued with when they are working with startups, and then slowly started to structureize uh, the Vixen program. And we have had two successful meetings already, one with Daimler and then one with Infineon last month, uh, wherein we had uh, corporates um, uh, together along with startups 
startups to create uh, a business, uh, create an idea of business collaboration between these two parties. And we also presented at the Asia Pacific Weeks in Berlin uh, in May this year. Um, at the Siemens Stadt in Berlin, which uh, is now going to be another startup space, so it was like a full circle coming around. Uh, so I'm very glad to have shared these points with you all. I, I really hope that there would be much more uh, support for this program since it's being run on such lean um, uh, backgrounds. And uh, if you really want to have any more feedback for us or if you would like to share some more thoughts on this, please do write to me. And thank you so much, Jose, for giving uh, this opportunity. I also thank the IA Summit and everybody else. Thank you so much. Thank you.